everybody i hope that you're doing well today i'm watching foodie beauty and of course all these people are wanting to get her attention and to make their content and i've made a new term you know colo it means a, a person that is looking for uh content and also relevance and clout colo okay uh and she has so many this shani and then you have all the other ones as well you know and like this goes on uh but i want to say that i see her you know and look i'm so grateful to her and i will explain you why and this is how life works and how everything you know doesn't make sense but it makes sense. always some kind of excuse oh yeah we're just making it up cassie oh yeah okay some kind of excuse yeah it is a fucking excuse and it's a valid one she's in heat the vet won't fix her what do you want from me? Yeah, they're giving her so much. And cut my leg off for but they you? would complain about anything. I'm so tired of this. This with the cat, it's just, I don't know. I also have my cat. I don't, I have also my, my cat situation, but my husband wants to make kittens. And it's his cat, and I'm not going to interfere, I'm not going to argue. have trigger food that's why I bring them in my house you know <sighs> eat a pile of shit <laughs> oh eat a pile of shit oh this is the part you know that I Thanks, appreciate I'm tired of or see professional help I, I already talked about this yeah, it's an, it's tiring. Just like Amberlynn Reed said the other day, hey, <clears throat> this is a job. This is a job. She's making her own content there. This is a job. And uh, yesterday, I don't know who it was. Somebody said that she's wearing the uh, hijab in order to hide her, her uh, double chins or her chins. And it's like, no, what about her hair? You know, like the people will... It is just so ridiculous, but this is not my point. The point is that I'm just so grateful to Foodie Beauty, and because without her, I would not have a, I would not have thought about YouTube channel or about anything regards YouTube. Let's put it like that. She was my motivation, my inspiration for me to pursue, you know, that uh, to continue to even if I knew I had no knowledge and no friends or any knowledge, I still, you know, I was so persistent. And you can see my bad videos at the very beginning. What you see these days, it's much better. And I want to say to you why the whole point of this video, I'm not getting to this. This, look at this. So in my restaurant, you know, I have, I have people that uh, I work with all in many things in life, you know. But let's go to restaurant in Bali. In Bali, I had my staff there. And in the kitchen, in the kitchen, uh, one of the chefs uh, was this person here and because this person here and uh, now i see that he's also making reactions he's also making reactions and isn't that amazing isn't life amazing exactly when i thought you know i thought to myself oh my god if, if people ask me you know how have you spent your time you know okay so uh, you didn't travel and you got married but how what have you been doing with your time and I can't say that, yeah, I have a big social life. No, I can't. I have to say I've been spending a lot of my time on YouTube, socially-wise, and, you know, my learnings and everything. I've Yeah, it's been that. And I've, I've felt so ashamed, and I still kind of feel ashamed, honestly. But uh, when I see this, I'm like, no, maybe actually why? Okay, I'm, I'm old, and I, I'm not good at it, but that doesn't matter, does it, or does it? Because, look, even other people, you know, that I worked with, they're doing it now. They're thinking of doing it. And he knows about my channel, about my reaction channel. Remember in Bali I started and th those people were still around. I started after I closed my restaurant. Fact. 
but uh, the people were still we were still in contact even if the restaurant was not in function and you know a lot of people were laughing at me with this YouTube they were laughing at me and they're still laughing at me today majority but you see in the end I'm not laughing right now at myself this is one moment where I'm not laughing at myself with my hobby and my how I spend my time and look it's interesting it's interesting isn't it it's so interesting you, I know you cannot relate to it but me I, this is we were working I like this is isn't that cool isn't this amazing life who knows maybe I have many other friends out there that are also on YouTube and I don't know you know okay In Bali, I also know, guys, I also have friends that are YouTubers. I have friends that are YouTubers, but they have like professional, they have professional channels, you know, about Bali and about, you know, like... Okay. Interesting, no? So yeah, I have in Bali also some friends that they are professional YouTubers, but you know, not with reactions or with that, with like, with nice content and you know, really nice editing, you know, with all those tourist effects like you see the travel channels have, you know, that kind. But uh, this was for me very pleasantly surprising and it just shows me, you know, like life, you never know about life. You think that you know everything or you judge maybe yourself too harsh, but in the end, you know, it's surprising it's life is just surprising and how things go together and how what happens and how things evolve you know like me and my I started uh, in import export uh, international import export business then I went into gastronomy business Vienna also my cafe the bar whilst still doing my uh, ventilation my internet being a supplier of HVAC products internationally and then I went uh, now I have entered this uh, YouTube, uh, not you cannot call it occupation, but a field of work. So I've done, you know, import, export, sales. I've done a gastronomy, restaurant and bar and club. And now it's not like I'm doing it, but now I can talk. I'm sorry, but I can talk as a YouTuber. I can say that I am a YouTuber. I have a YouTube channel and I'm not going to be embarrassed about it anymore. I've decided I'm not going to be embarrassed about it anymore. And uh, I'm so happy to see that, you know, I'm not the only one. And uh, like I said, in Vienna, there's also a group of a uh, meetup. There's a meetup of just for YouTube uh, creators. Not Is it YouTube creators? or I don't know which one, but it is, has to do with platforms, you know. Not really. It's also influencers. I don't know exactly. But anyways, there's a meetup where all the people, you know, in Austria and they meet up and they talk about you know their youtube experience and then maybe you can uh for sure not maybe for sure you can hook up with some people maybe create something better you know create something you know of of relevance not like me mine is just like a a channel of my archiving my life me ranting and quacking around making jokes and basically it's like a diary it's nothing it's not a really professional it's not a professional channel but uh I have learned so much, you know, and once again, we go back to this To I've learned so much thanks to Foodie Beauty, because if it were not for her, I would have never ever seen myself, you know, where I am today. Yes, I hope I impressed you with my video and it touched you and it made you think a little bit about life. I wish you all a very good day.
peace, peace, peace.